Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Imagine Teacher. This is only part two, so we are on day one, week two. We shall continue. Monday morning! I don't remember if we did the schedule already or not. Okay, William, let's go see your teacher. Are you nervous? No, Dad, I'm not nervous. Is the teacher nice? He looks like he's gonna throw up. Let's see. Oh, there we go. Now you guys can see better. Yes, she's very nice. She has a lovely smile. Yeah, that has a lot to do with being nice. Hello, Mr. Manzit. Have you brought me a new student? Yes, this is my son William. He's Jeremy's friend. Hello, Mrs. April. Haha, <laughs> you know, I'm still young. I'm not married yet. I think we've seen this dialogue already. Okay. I'm eating some goldfish crackers. Don't mind me. Mmm. Mm. Okay. Mmm. Getting trickier. So, we're gonna start with... One, two, three, four, five. Wait. <coughs> Shoot! Okay, so this guy can't be near him. You can't be near her, so boom. You can just sit over here all low so the new kid can interact and stuff. Okay. How ominous. It's like Sesame Street. Da, 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 da. Okay. Whose homework do we have to correct? Oh, no one's. I'm gonna talk to all my friends. I don't know why she talks like Michael Jackson now, sorry. See, Mr. Colton, the school already has another student. Oh god, he's got- I keep forgetting his face. That was wonderful news. I'm so pleased. Congratulations. I knew I was ready to believe in you. Do you think the school is on the right track? Of course. Mr. Manzit brought William thanks to our results. I think I'll be able to retire without any worries. Yes, please retire. We're tired of looking at your face. You're leaving so soon, Mr. Coddleton? When? Are you sure? Let's say I'll leave at the end of the week. Cool. You see, I still have a lot of papers to organize. If you need me, don't hesitate to call. Yeah, I will definitely not need you. Recess is over. Let's get back to class. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then... You can't be next to this kid, so... Oh god, it's math. I hate math. See, this part isn't so bad yet. Disorder?! What do you mean, disorder? Should I have yelled at him? What what was I supposed to do there? Um, okay. Two. Count the bears. Ah, uh, three. That's a one, you fool. Mm 
really likes three. Two and three are like its favorite number. Okay, ginger kid. Uh, wrong. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yeah. really sad how hard that is for me as a grown ass adult. Oh yeah, we gotta clean. My god, so much dirt. Crazy how much dirt they track in. What happens if we personalize? Mm. Well. Oh. I guess I'd have to, like, shop, huh? I don't remember if I mentioned something to you. What is it, Mr. Collinson? Each week, you'll have to concentrate on a certain subject. That way, you'll help the students progress. For example, this week, it's science. Each week, the subject will be different. That way, our students will receive a solid education. All right, Mr. Collinson, I'll take care of it. Um, so, how do I buy shit? Inventory's in the cupboard. I have a ball. Um, can I shop? Ooh. Music decorations. Animal Kingdom. A stable paintbrush. Glue. An eraser. A palette. Music. Paintbrush. Paper. Animal Kingdom. Eraser. Glue. Hell yeah. Go to class. Okay, so, Blondie can't be next to this kid. No, he can get my body shot. So, okay. You, 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 you. Better not disorder this time. Um... Who's being disorderly? Ha ha! Disorder! Disorder on your mother! The wheel of mediocrity. What?
Sheesh. Silly children mixing up their letters. Hmm. Hmm. That does not surprise me. Okay, biology. Hello. Disorder on your cow. Oh, you're going to get it. Yeah, right, you won't do it again. You do it every time we study now. Rotten little children. Sheesh. Pay attention. Stop standing in your chairs and shit. How dare you. Oh, it decided my lines weren't straight enough for it. Okay, so. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm. Hey! You guys saw, but that was not wrong. Of course it's you. Little Miss Goody Two Shoes who is standing in her seat. How is that a shark? You just got it right the one before it. No, but it gets eaten by owls. So do you. Alright. This child I thought was smart, but apparently not. An owl monkey? How about a howler monkey? That's a thing. Has owl in the name. Don't we have a janitor for this? We're supposed to. Where's the school budget funding going to? Um. Uh -huh. Hmm. Where's my other stuff go then? 
guess that I'll have to do for now. Miss April, just one more little thing. Yes, what is it, Mr. Cobbleton? We still haven't discussed the staff meeting. What is it? I still have time, right? Unfortunately not, it's every week. Ms. Sharp, the school's district inspector, as well as Mr. Manzid, who represents the parents. We're inspected by the district? Yes, in fact, the future of the school is still not secure. The district isn't sure if it's worth keeping us open, so don't fuck up. So what's the inspector like? I know her a little. It'll be fine, you'll see. Uh-huh. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, who's fighting today, so... These need to get huh? Well... We're gonna read today! Punk. Detention! Ooh. You disordered rat as we were finishing. You knew you'd get away with it, you little punk. Hmm. Blondie, I thought you were smart. You're better than this. Dolphins. Hmm. I don't want to rub the images in the book. How long till somebody disorders? So far, they're behaving too well. They're too quiet. They know the wrath of geometry is upon them. Mm-hmm. Okay. Boom. Bitty bees, where is it? Mm, you in the back of the class. Troublemaker. Wrong. Wrong. I guess that one's right. Jeremy, what the hell? <laughs> it's a cat. <laughs> a confused cat that is listening. Another cat. 
a boat. <clears throat> Woo. Wait, what am I doing? Anything else to buy? Wait, that's not where we buy. No. Uh... Those are files. I have no freaking clue, guys. Alright. So these two. And these two. Oh, okay. So, Gingy, you're gonna sit in the back. Wait. Crap. Well, that was a mistake. Guess we're gonna have some disorder. How do I move on? I want to move him. Hmm. Well, guess we're stuck with it. Surprise there's not disorder with how much those two hate each other. Hmm. Well. Literally the same ones. Oh my goodness. And again. Imagine cavemen on soda, that'd be great. You gave this kid the same question three times in a row. Well, it could be today. So could that. Geography. Guess who's about to fail? The only place in the world that they know Americans would be able to answer this for. Okay. 
Okay, you've been quiet for a while. Let's see how you did, Louise. But I don't. Nope. Nope. Yep. Yep. Nope. 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 Alrighty then. Hmm. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. A couple of them found what they want to be. I thought only one kid at a time discovered that, so I wasn't paying that close of attention to who all it was, and now I feel bad. So we're just gonna go through a bunch of the files. Okay, she was one of them, right? A pediatrician, good choice. Fireman, okay, maybe it was you. Policeman. Okay. Fair enough. All solid choices. You and you cannot be together. You and you cannot be together. So you and you. 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 And you. Yeah? We good? Cool. Stupid scratchy book. This is not what studying math is supposed to look like. But look how much better behaved they are now, now that I've yelled at them a few times. Probably once we get new students, they'll start up again. Oh! I jinxed it! Get your butt in that seat before I duct tape it down. This is why I could never be a teacher. I probably would duct tape them down in the seat. Uh, one. <laughs> okay, smarty pants. Uh, probably wrong. What happens when they fill this all up? Do they like graduate and leave class? So children, are you enjoying your trip to the zoo? I don't know what this accent is, holy crap. Oh yes, Mr. Frick, it's more fun than sitting in biology. Oh, look over there, giraffes. Oh, okay. You organized a party for me? That's so nice! Oh god, he's creepy. Of course, you've done so much for the school. Even so, it's very strange, I think I'm touched. Don't worry, Mr. Coddleton. We all really wanted to. April, you're now ready to manage the school on your own, yes, after two weeks. Children, I have something important to tell you. Promise that you'll be just as good with, with April as you are with me. Wait, if it was Friday night, why is it still light out? And why are the kids still here? Mm-hmm. 
Goodbye to you all, I'm going fishing. Yes, please do. Never come back. Staff meeting, oh shiz. Let's begin the first staff meeting. Let's see what are your results for this week. Okay. Congratulations, your science lessons went well. Hmm. At least we got no boo! <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Everything's fine. Keep up the good work. Again, I don't know what this accent is. Based on your results, the school district is granting you monies. I'm sure you'll put this money to good use. Let me take a look at the class schedule. Next week, the focus will be on English. You must achieve a minimum score in this subject. So, at least a six- That's easy! Very well, make note of my planner. I'm sure you'll meet the objective, yes? Parents just gave me a list for next week. Parents assignments, night classes. Oh, oh, okay. Night classes would be... Book- Wait, what? What? Well, parents signed her up for school. Be in your class on Monday morning. Hmm. Well. Um, so I love how none of the ones that were for night classes even show the hell up, but okay. So we've got writing, reading, arithmetic, biology, geography, music, drawing, and film. Ooh, we have film. Let's put the film at the end of the week. We'll put the drawing at the start of the week. We'll put music in the middle of the week. Writing. Math and reading. Reading and geography. Biology and writing. How's that work for you? yeah? Okay. So, inventory, shopping. Woo, we can buy more things. Hell yeah. Wait, I think we already have these things, but that's okay. Oh darn, no graph paper for you -hoo. Oh darn. Okay, so we have new kid. Oh, we have a black kid, cool. Alright, so, these two... And then these two cannot be together. So you, and you, then you, 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 and you, yeah? We good? Coolio! Scribble these scribble. It really does create a crown effect with all the little holidays it's intentionally leaving. Even though that's kind of just like a hardware limitation of the DS, but that's okay. It works for this purpose. something I'd like to do. Oh, okay. We should check that out. How about we play school? I'll be April. Oh, how cute! Alright, little kid after my own heart. You're adorable. Hmm, what are Yvonne and Louise talking about? What's wrong? You're really quiet today. Because I have nothing special to say. Did something happened at school? No, nothing happened at school at all. Aren't you at school? So what is it then? It's not a normal day, it's my birthday. I didn't know that, that's great! We should have a party with a cake and lots of presents! I'll gladly organize something for her birthday. That way the whole class can help. Let's get to work. Aww, aren't you sweet? Okay. So, we were gonna look at files, see what these kids wanna be. 
Oh, or a singer. How cute. Or an architect. Okay. Fair enough. Okay. So, you and you cannot go together, and you and you cannot go together. So, how about you and you, you and you, and you and you. Will that work? Hopefully. No disorders. I expected better from you. Oh, come on. Okay. Last letter in the world. That's an easy one. Fourth. First letter. Second letter. Last letter. Close enough for you? Really? Okay. Really, Jeremy? You're just messing with me. I know you are. She wants to do too. Okay, let's personalize first. Woohoo! No, no, I want music. Nah, lion was better. So much dirt. I guess with that many kids, there's gonna be a lot of dirt, but still. Okay. Hello, Miss April. Hello, Miss Sharp. What a surprise to see you at school during the week. I wanted to come by and say hello. I was wondering if everything was going well. It's fine, but I've been running into some difficulties. Mr. Collington has left. There aren't many students. I really have a lot of work. You're all alone, I know the feeling. You can count on me, you know. I'm so glad you're here, Miss Sharp. Yeah, yell at these kids for me. Smack them around a bit. Okay. So you do, and you do again. Hey! 
She clearly has not learned my wrath. Also three. Click on the kids that didn't raise their hand. Mm -hmm. Uh, wrong? Uh. Not bad. Oh, I didn't really like that. Well, sorry that I got one question wrong. Jeez. Oh, yeah, we're gonna check the files. See what her other thingy is now. Oh, she wants to be a teacher. Oh, she wants to be like me. Me, you. I saw your hair sticking up over the book. Really? <sighs> Making it quite difficult here. Quite difficult. homework are we going to, uh, correct? Yours. Don't let me down, kiddo. Lawyer does not have an H in it. Talked it all. Okay, I'm clean up the classroom. My God, look at all the dirt. Make it a class period. Hey, you're gonna sweep this room because you have no problem making such a mess in it. Help me clean it. Life skills class. Do them so good. Wednesday morning. Okay, so you 
and you can't be together. And you and you can't be together. So how about you and you be together? Okay. Yeah, that could work. Photographer, all right. You and you, you and you. Oh, come on! Really? It's always you! I feel like it's almost becoming a stereotype thing. It's kinda racist. Just saying. <laughs> that is not a pigeon. Nor is that a kangaroo. Or that. That's not a chicken, but they eat chicken. Jeremy, you're a friggin' idiot. Understood everything. I wonder what happens if you don't clean. Like if it impairs their learning or something. I kind of don't want to find out though. You two are getting along again, at least, so... At least for now. Louise, can we not make it through one freaking class period? Like, honestly, though... Like, do you need meds? Do you need some Ritalin? Uh, uh, crap! 
Where is it? W? Uh oh. Uh oh. No. I get up. I don't know. R. No! Now we're gonna get a boo! Restart. Okay. Not a problem. I'd be happy to restart that one. D. Alright. See how much better that went. Really, Louise? Little Miss, I can't focus on studying, but you want me to click to work. Okay. Mm hmm. Okay, what do you want to do? Called it. She always wants to play teacher at recess. I knew it would pop up. That's so cute. Okay. If it's the same geography assignment we've had to do over and over, this should be easy. It is. Louise can okay. Maybe she's trying for self-improvement, which is good if she is. <laughs> oh my god. Louise, honey, are you dyslexic? I think you might be dyslexic. Oh, what do you want to do, Jeremy? Okay. A journalist, okay. So, the 
two original girls can't be together, and Jeremy and the new girl can't be together. So, you and you are gonna go together. You and you, you and you. Cool. Here we go. And then somebody's gonna want me to correct their work. Who's it gonna be? Oh, okay. My goodness. <laughs> well, her grades are slowly coming up. I don't know what game to play. Okay, children. No talking during the show. It's a lizard or a crocodile and a hedgehog. Of course not, Mr. Frick. I like movies too much for that. Oh, they literally went to the movies. We'd all rather watch a movie than talk. Then why are you talking? Now it's time for the staff meeting. Okay. Let's begin the, oh, let's begin the second staff meeting. Let's see what are your results for this week. Yeah, we kind of sucked at writing. Congratulations, your English lessons went well. Hmm. Now the results for the other lessons. Everything's fine. Keep up the good work. Based on your results, the school district is granting you money. I'm sure you put this money to good use. Let me take a moment to look at the class schedule. Next week, the focus will be on art. You must achieve a minimum score in this subject. At least 62, okay. Very well, making out a bit of my planner. I'm sure you need the objective, don't you? The parents gave me a list for next week. My class is... Science. And art. Last items, Lila's stuffed rabbit. Okay, I've got it. Lila's parents signed her up for school. She'll be in your class on Monday morning. Oh wait, he's not her. Um, how is Leela's stuffed rabbit lost in the school if she's never been to the school? Good, then have a lovely week, April. Thank you, April. Good luck, and see you next week. Thank you both. Goodbye. Oh, who is he? You want to see me, Mr. Thistle? Whoa! <laughs> His face. Did you know that this week is science week? No, it's not. It's art week. Um, yes, indeed. I had heard of it, but I was wondering what you were planning to do at the school. Planning? Um, school? Uh, you didn't plan anything. I'll ask Miss April to take care of it. What a shame. Well, ask her then. Yes, I'll ask her right away. He's cute. Okay.
Hmm. Let's start with art and end with a trip to the museum. We'll have music, pottery, whoa, more art, and then fill in the gaps. Yeah, like that. And then, can we save? Yes. And just like that, that is another episode of Let's Play Imagine Teacher. Uh, yeah, it's a little bit of a lengthier one than our last game that we just completed in literally three episodes. This one will take more time than that, but it's kind of worth it just to see the class size grow and everything. But yeah, so I will see you next week. See ya.